Wonderful Weeaboo. And I'm Afro Man. Oh, yeah. Shoot. Shoot all the blacks. What am I, a cop? Oh, I shoot all the blackies. There you go. Hacking them, that's how you hack. It's trying to hack us. If we take hacking damage, it'll affect our bodies as well. <laughs> to me! <coughs> to a top-down shooter. There you go. Oh, thank God. Yeah. So if you don't, uh, if you don't, like, defeat that thing in a certain time span, I think you take, like, double damage. Oh, no. Oh, it's my lava. You gotta jump when, when that happens. Like, well, it just, like, came out of the yeah, they, they do. They, come, they can literally come out of nowhere. That's why for, for, the, for this aspect, you might have to do a lot of like aerial, com aerial combos and stuff like that. Alright, wait for this cup, do I know you want to chew on shit? This is more difficult than, than, like, than I thought. You made this like double difficult because you're like under leveled. Uh, they're throwing mechanics at you that you've never seen before. The thing is, you're doing really well. And I'm actually I'm proud of you. Eh, I, I try. I really like this, like, boss. Oh, yeah. Like, like, this is why this this whole area is my favorite, just because of everything is happening at once. Well, like, I like the flavor text of the characters, like, their, like, their motive is being more beautiful. Like, type of thing. Yeah. I, I like the flavor text of that. It's a really fun, like, um, character trope. Like, of a, of a vain, like, villain. Mm-hmm. Because because there's something psychologically wrong with them. It's mostly about the psychological aspects of it. That, yeah, they're interesting. Now I'm just wondering why is she carrying corpses on her body? Yeah, but I, I will have to grind like soon. Oh fuck! Yeah, this sort of reminds me of the Del DMC game, like the reboot. Yeah, there was like <laughs> there, there's literally a boss like this. I and like they were the only they were the only bosses that were actually uh, well thought out. Oh, fuck. 
so well. I think I think it's just like I was trying to like <coughs> like I was on Vault Sav. What was it? Oh yeah. No, I don't think you have. I don't think you had any more uh, recovery items. I had small recovery. Did you? Yeah. I might use it all up uh, when you first uh, started using your stuff. I think you might have just like one of each left. I think. I think I had four if I remember right. Are we seriously being attacked with death? Oh, is it the second phase? We yeah, she's trying the second phase. Now where is my body? Uh, I think it's on the outskirts somewhere. They were dead. They've been turned into weapons. There it is. Alright. This ends in At least, it, at least it got me to the point where I was before. Oh yeah. Yeah, because I have uh, I have these. I see you have four. Okay. Yeah, yeah. Oh, we're at this section, huh? Yep, you're in a halfway part. I really want to get into virtual YouTubers, like like the the like like find like finding a good one, uh -huh. because I, I like the concept. Because then again, it's just a, an anime character that's uh, fully animated by a puppeteer. Yeah, but they, they still they still do work though. Yeah, puppeteering is like hard work still. Oh yeah, like <clears throat> there's no doubt about it. I, 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 like, there's something about, like, someone trying to motion track these, like, characters. Like, and so it feels more real. Yeah. Man, those fuck. Okay, no. I was about to say, those fucking, um. Lasers was fucking thin as fuck. Or more or less just the, the, the red dot before I think it's coming out. Because I, I love that this game is kind of just like, we can we can make these just come out of nowhere. But no, we'll, we'll, we'll at least let them... We'll, tell, we'll, we'll at least telegraph. Yeah, before, before we actually just like drop them out like that. So if you get hit, that's on you. Oh, so apparently like uh, someone played uh, Mario, Mario, uh, Mario the Odyssey mm -hmm. without doing a single jump. A jump. Man, it's possible. It's just really hard, you know, oh, to... Yeah. But... You just got the mechanics inside it out. Because, like, how, how he did it was, um... Like, how he finally did it was, um... Putting the second player in there. Oh. Cool. And just played it exclusively as the second, second player. So it doesn't register as a jump. Yeah, that makes sense. And apparently, like, uh... Apparently, <laughs> when you, like, talk to... Like somebody that counts as a jump. How that count as a jump? Because you're pushing the jump button to interact. That makes literally no sense. Yeah. That makes no it, it's sense. Just, it's just <coughs> like if I press the, if I press the jump button to talk to somebody, I'm jumping. How? Well, like it's, it's just a like a it's just a like it's just a programming thing where like they didn't think that like. Uh, they didn't think of that contingency plan. Well, like they didn't think of that like uh, in the long run because they didn't think anyone would try to like beat the game without running. So yeah. like, so it gives you like a, it gives you like some false numbers about your statistics because it isn't technically a jump. It's just, it's just like, that just that's really just arbitrary for me then. Because like, you do like push the jump and like the jump animation, but like it cancels out because you're talking to somebody. But that doesn't. That means you didn't jump then, because it got it got canceled out. But how you, how you make it not a jump is uh, ground pounding and then pushing a. So it's still it's still you pressing the, the jump button. It's just that it's being canceled out by another animation. Yeah, and apparently, like uh, if you're jumping as 
a possessed character that doesn't count as a jump. How does that not count as jump? Because, like, there's a mechanic uh, in the game where it counts your jumps. That makes no sense. And there's, o- there's only, like, uh, like, <coughs> there's only, like, like, you get, like, um, there's only, like, one, like, um, there's only, like, one thing where, like, you, um, one instance where you actually have to jump to continue the game. Like, press it once. Mm-hmm. And that's, like, uh, during the final battle to try and wake up. Trying to get battle in the way, yeah. Yeah, but like I've been playing Bullet Hells for a couple of days. Like before, I was playing Mother Gunship, mm. and like that's a fucking bullet hell as fuck. Oh yeah. But I'm surprised I'm doing this well. Yeah, well, you're just shooting, you're not actually going in. But it does, that does make a lot of sense. And you're you're hella low level, so yeah, it makes it so it stay back as far as possible. The one game I wish I like I um, I didn't sell was that Suda Fifty One game, Shadow of the Damned, or something like that. Oh, that yeah, yeah. I, it was that game wasn't for me. Like I real I realized after after a while of playing it like yeah this is definitely not uh, for me. like it just it just stopped like there's one part where like that like it was impossible for me to play like uh, because of the difficulty yeah that was on normal there was just one section where I where it was a, it was like a a tower defense section essentially but with uh, with a with a uh, but it made you shoot with the big boner yeah. For me, it just felt the shooting felt stiff, and I was like, I can't, I, I can't shoot like this. This is this is the weirdest way to actually shoot anything. <laughs> 